Going down. Someone wanted a second dessert. I won't mention names, but. Leave me alone. <laughs> is sore we're gonna go eat <laughs> so my mouth is sore because a week ago I got a crown put in and prior to that the temporary crown cracked so I, it was exposed for about two or three days before they could actually get to it because it was the weekend so they put the permanent crown in about a week ago the pain was only supposed to last about a week but now it's over a week so I, I am afraid that I will probably need a root canal when I get back different beast in the morning as you can see Mr. Bees.
last thing he thought he was ever going to do today on his trip to New Orleans was tie another man up in front of a church. This is a straight jacket escape. And I know what some of you guys are thinking. They're like, look at those pants even on Easter. Easter. <laughs> There's no way that that jacket's straight. Wow, quiet crowd. It's okay. It's just jokes, people. I'm not gay. My husband is. Oh, and we're back. It's true, I've been all over the sucker, man. I've been to 51 countries and Texas. <laughs> Doing shows just like this for people just like you. And I really am a stand-up comedian. Nobody ever believes this. But check it out. I have got, I'm going to share this with you, because this is awesome. I've got kick-ass news. Last Tuesday, yours truly here just signed a contract with HBO. Yeah? Yeah, seriously. Thank you so much. It's awesome. It's 14 bucks a month. I get Max and all that other shit. That's for like a year. And every time I come back here to the States, the media is like, oh, it's such a divided nation. Well, not from where I'm standing, baby. So if you're a liberal, then I'm an artist. If you are a conservative, I'm a small business. <laughs> Something here for everyone. But the only thing I ask in return is go home to wherever you're from. Tell your friends, your family, and love homes are a kick-ass city New Orleans is, yeah? <laughs> Tell them to have a great laugh with all these people, right? <laughs> So this is the problem when you walk everywhere. I have to poop and we have to find a place where I can poop. Are you saying you have to poop because the walking is making you need to poop? Yeah, oh. exactly. <laughs> we'll find a bathroom though. It literally goes from like chaotic and super loud to extremely quiet real quick. So we're just walking, looking at the area. I found the bathroom. I dropped the deuce. Yeah, I dropped the deuce. This is our form of transportation today. This is delicious. The briskets, what you should get here, 100%. That was the second best restaurant that we ate at. First one would have to be Maypop. It was fantastic. The brisket, whew, delicious. Highly recommend. My tooth still hurts, but eating's worth it because you don't want to regret going back to Seattle and wishing that you would have ate something. Flavor's worth the pain, I guess. <laughs> um, we're waiting on our lift to go back to the airport and head back to reality.